What is good, y'all? Welcome back to my podcast. So, if you're just tuning in to my video and if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I appreciate you for watching me and subscribing to my content if you're new to my channel. So, yeah, with that being said, let's get into some big reveals that everybody is talking about on Twitter. And I've already done the Street Fighter X Power Rangers figures. Go check it out. And I already did the Time Force Blue and Snizzler. It's already out. So, Max Cooper, Blue Wild Force Ranger. He looks cool. He looks unique. He looks interesting. It's not perfect, especially the head sculpture. But for the most part, I'll accept it for what it is. I mean, it's his first figure. So, Wild Force Blue Ranger is out now. Go check it out. But this right here, Dino Charge Blue Ranger coded, and shout out to Yoshi Sodoso. This figure looks perfect. It looks exactly like Coda. The head sculpture looks just like him. And I just love it. I really love it a lot. And the effects on the figures themselves, they're pretty cool. But this right here is what I'm mostly excited about is Zoe Beast Morphous Yellow Ranger because everybody has been talking about this how they want a zoe figure well here you go they're finally giving this to us and we've been asking about this for years and boom there you have it they're already giving it to us and i love what i'm seeing zoe herself looks so good she looks exactly like her actress and shout outs to jacqueline she did a good job as zoe even though her character on the show was uh, you know she was underutilized or overutilized a little bit though but that's just my honest opinion but the fact that she gets to have her figure herself this is history of the making now the whole beast morphers team is almost complete and um this wannabe morpher i'm gonna pass on this i'm not a fan of these morphers the voiceovers i mean the voice samples are just cringe i'm sorry i don't like them but Zeno from Down on Fury also has a debut on Legacy Wars. And I've seen the gameplay itself fire, better combos, better movesets. And Zeno is from Ravcon, so don't mess with them Ravcon people. Like, they don't play that mess. So, so Ravcon, I mean, so Zeno is going to be debuting on Legacy Wars. And I can only imagine them bringing these characters into battle for the grid now we've seen a preview of episode 14 of dino fury and it's an interesting episode because lord zed is in it as well as squash you know squasso i mean squasso and everybody else from the previous seasons are returning for this season for better plot wise and this one is interesting but the part that got to me when i uh, wanted to go get it for himself so yeah, then we get to Ryan in the whole Boom Studio comics of how he wanted to turn Jason into a Death Ranger. And I've seen the reviews on YouTube and my God, they're more brutal than when you read them in person. So here's the thing, this image alone looks insane. Jason looks like a Kenshi Death from Mortal Kombat. And this is the, I believe Jason who is looking possessed as a death ranger thanks to the death ranger himself and this shot is from jason and tommy i don't know if this is from the necessary evil art which i hate the most and you recognize this well you recognize this art style from the goku power which is one i mean goku power was just one my apologies i'm i'm so over the place i'm tired i've been out all day so this comic is from the goku power which is one and this shot right here is really cool jason and the andros you've seen jason with the dragon shield i wonder if this is like a flashback i'm not sure but this is interesting and i don't know about this shot i don't like it but this right here looks like you see something out of a into the spidey verse with the animation and the art style this is what this kind of reminds me of and i see that you know what I'm saying i see nothing wrong with it this is different from a different artist standpoint this is probably their take on jason and I don't know if, I don't know who is this supposed to be on the right side. I know who Death Ranger is, but I don't know who this is supposed to be. Now you've seen this 
part this is the artist from the original many move of power which is run which i've always liked his style and it's cool i like it so after that you know we went on what no they actually went on to reveal some i guess some power on your pillows which i'm gonna pass on that as well because i don't want a power on just pillow so at the end of the day fan first thursday was great what y'all thoughts on this let me know in the comments down below and tell me what are you mostly excited about you know what to do put it in the chat